talking to one person from the baseball world today who said, do you want to be Derek Jeter, which is a Yankee for life and a captain, or do you want to be Robinson Cano? who left the Yankees and went to Seattle for more money. Now, I'm not saying Aaron Judge is going to leave and that there's even going to be more money out there. It's just one way to look at this scenario. I also think from what Hal Steinbrenner has said, guys, I don't imagine the Yankees are going to allow themselves to be outbid. I think they have expressed how much they believe in Judge and how much he means to them. Yeah, I think the greatest thing is the open dialogue that we're starting to hear. And I mentioned Aaron Judge saying, I'm going to sit back and listen to all these other offers. Well, he has also said whatever, whatever team he signs with, he wants to get it done sooner rather than later so they can go out and finish up the job filling out their roster. So I think this is probably the opening chapter of this story where Aaron can sit back, listen to everybody else and what they have to say. He already knows what the Yankee offer is. He already knows the, everything that goes about being a Yankee and what that means. So when you hear everything from all these other clubs, then you go back to Brian Cashman, your agent and say listen this probably sounds like the place I want to be let's get some wheels moving in the right direction and then that's probably when you would see it speed up a little bit maybe I'm guessing around the time of the winter meetings I thought it was interesting that judge referenced the winter meetings in one of his recent interviews and you're right flash you get a chance to be courted and any player wants to be courted but I think the Yankees are putting on their own version of a full court press in the sense that you've heard what Cashman has had to say. You've heard what Steinbrenner has had to say. Brian Cashman is talking about being on the clock because it's such a pivotal part of their offseason. It is the primary goal in the offseason is to make sure that Aaron Judge stays as a Yankee and then you start to put the pieces in around him. We haven't talked about the scenario of Judge not being a Yankee, but if that were to happen, you want to be able to move to whatever your plan B or plan C is. I don't think the Yankees want to even envision going there. The plan A is Judge, and that's where the focus is. Now,